Hi folks, Chris here from the Javelin Tech Team, looking to show you some fantastic new assembly functionality within SolidWorks 2015. With the assembly-based chain pattern tool, we can more accurately simulate link-based power transmission chains and belts. The chain component pattern can be found up in the command manager along with the other component-driven pattern tools. When we activate the tool, we'll be asked to select one of three different pitch methods, as well as the path for the chain. The three different pitch methods available are distance, distance linkage, and connected linkage. We'll then go ahead and use the selection manager to choose the path for our chain. The closed loop option should suffice here, to give us one completely enclosed loop along which the links will propagate. Let's move down to the chain group portion of the dialog and select the link that we're going to use to propagate about the path. We'll do a quick switch over here to the connected link pitch method. We'll then specify the surfaces that will represent the pitch distance of the link within our belt. And lastly, We'll navigate down through the feature tree of the link component in order to specify a plane that will be used to align all the pattern segments within the belt. Let's check out the bottom of the property manager to the options that specify whether or not our chain component pattern is static or dynamic. Let's confirm our selections at the top of the dialog by choosing the OK button and check out that dynamic pattern. If we combine the dynamic drag ability that the chain pattern gives us along with a pre-existing rack and pinion mate that I had set up earlier, we end up with a very powerful combination that allows us to dynamically drag within our assembly file and simulate the motion of our belts, chains, and their related sprockets. As we zoom out to take in the entire assembly, we can see that we've simulated the movement of the entire system with a few well-placed gear mates driving all three sprockets. Thanks for watching and be sure to stay tuned for more new features within SolidWorks 2015.